Welcome back to the Ultimate Egg Drop Experiment Lesson 2. In the first lesson, we went over the first two steps of the engineering design process. Step one being, ask and properly define the problem. Step two was brainstorming. I had you all research some resources so you all could see the other ideas people have completed for the egg drop experiment, ones that did work and ones that didn't work. Today we are going to begin step three, which is the design process. But before we do any designing, I need to specify the requirements for this experiment. I'm going to keep the requirements as simple as possible. The first requirement for this experiment is that the egg must fall between 15 to 25 feet without being cracked. The second requirement is that you can only use materials located in or around your house to build your egg drop capsule. The third requirement is to have fun. Now let's talk about what your assignment is for today. You are going to be tasked with coming up with three different egg drop capsule ideas. Here's an example. As you can see, this is a balloon design. I have multiple different balloons that are going to be tied together in the middle. I will then wrap Captain Egghead in some bubble wrap and place him inside this cluster of balloons. The pros to this design are that I believe the balloons will provide enough surface area to slow down the fall and on impact it's going to be bouncy against the ground. Now the con with this design is that the balloons might pop when they hit the ground. And if that happens, the egg will just completely drop to the ground and I can only hope that the bubble wrap will save it. Now just to restate what your assignment is, you are to come up with three different egg drop capsule ideas with the pros and cons to each design. I hope everyone has fun and I'll see you for the next lesson.